Five days ago, 14 new housemates entered the celebrity Big Brother house. You know what the word team stands for, T-E-A-M? Together, everyone achieves more. But the team spirit didn't last long. I predict a riot. You should be careful what you say, mate. Stand up. Why? Because I ask you to. You have to come back in the bedroom. Sorry. Shut your mouth. Hey, don't speak to me now, I won't speak to you. Shut up. Tonight, tempers explode. Stay away from me forever. Thank you very much. Lisa, no, no, no. Be very careful. careful. Don't, don't cross me. You act like you're this big spiritual guru and wipe that smirk off your <laughs> face. <laughs> you're very funny. That's a horrid man. It's like prison. I just can't stay in here. The gloves are off and it's game on. Welcome to Celebrity Big Brother. It is shaping up to be an absolute corker, isn't it? Oh! <laughs> Yesterday, tensions rose and tempers flared in the house. We'll be bringing you all the latest action in a little while. Plus, we have got some ex-celebrity housemates who are going to be here giving their verdict on all of the drama so far. But even more important than all of that, we would like you to take a look at this. <laughs> this is the celebrity scrap heap. Uh, <laughs> oh, indeed. Uh, now, you have been voting since Wednesday for your star of the show, and tonight the celebrity you've chosen will be revealed, <laughs> and they will then banish two of their fellow housemates to the scrap heap live, <laughs> face to face. Now, those two will be excluded from the house, uh, forced to live on the celebrity scrap heap until further notice. Uh, the vote for the star of the show is still open via the Celebrity Big Brother app, so all you have to do is click on the poll icon and select your star. It's absolutely free, but you must make sure that you downloaded the latest update if you want to take part. All straight with that? <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, so let's dive straight into the drama from yesterday. And it all started with a daybreak debrief. Day 4, 7.32 a.m. Whilst most of the housemates are asleep, Frenchie and Kelly are first up this morning. No, I'm awake. Once I'm awake, it's done. I have so much energy. Last night, Frenchie and Leslie had a big bust up. Shut your mouth. No, we are. It's my turn to talk. Okay. Okay, I'm Let me tell you something. When you come through the door right here, you shut your trap. You be quiet. You don't crawl over me. That's rude. So we were having so much fun and everybody just ruined it being mad at us. And you just ruined everything. So yeah, but I don't know why everybody got mad. Like, we're here to have fun, memories. Like, it was a campus. Everybody needs to go to bed. What the hell? You don't tell them to stop, do you? Of course not, never. You just be yourself. Because I am myself. And if I get kicked out, I don't even care because I'm just going to be me and that's all you can do. Did I have a hissy fit or did I dream it? Sorry? Did I have a hissy fit or did I dream it? You oh, dreamed you it. did, Leslie. Oh. oh, I just need a good night's rest. Mm. I'm going to confiscate this bed. I'm going to tell she can't sleep here. Yeah, we're talking about that last Ooh, night. Yeah. We're find somewhere this else. is my bed. Crazy. <laughs> the evil queen is confiscating this bed. This is my bed. So cold. Frenchie, you're losing your bed, babe. Huh? <laughs> you're losing your, your bed. bed. Oh, it's okay. I sleep inside the house. I was good. <laughs> so you guys can sleep, you know what I mean? If I did stay, I would have been like never, never sleeping. Everybody got mad, but we did try not to do noise, yeah, you know? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Frenchie has come to talk to Big Brother. Good morning, Frenchie. How are you? I feel okay. Did you sleep well? Well, kinda. 
Leslie got really mad, like really mad. I've never seen him mad like that. And um, told us, especially told me because I'm louder, um, that we were rude and really loud. And I really do believe that if we communicate, communicate and communicate, then everybody understands maybe somebody did something really upsetting. But if we explain what's happened, maybe then it's not that bad, as bad as we thought. Because everybody was sleeping, so they have no idea what's, what's, what we did really and what's happened. Twelve nineteen p.m. James is up to something. Oh, that's some freaky shit, man. Ow. Hey, you no. got your one coming. That's know, the sort um, of thing that keeps me awake. Can I get you or not? Yeah, look. <laughs> Does it come up here? <laughs> look at that. <laughs> oh, yeah. It comes up here. It's got me like a good one. Oh, right, right in the crack of your ass. <laughs> That's a nice ass. <laughs> you just cleaned all my winnets off. <laughs> my Klingons. I got the Klingons You just got rid of my Klingons. <laughs> Kelly is having a moment. Kelly, you want to talk or do you just want to rest? No, I'm all right then. I just don't want to be there. You don't want to be here. Sorry? You don't want to be here. Not, not at the moment. Yeah. But I'm not going to let it beat me. Plus, I don't want to break down on bloody national TV. Leslie is telling James about the film industry. But listen, they have a hard on for Brits. You should get over there. Especially with my reduction, I'll you be right now. You help me, I'll help you. Mm -hmm. I'm your ticket to Hollywood, baby. No, I'm a shepherd, I'm not a wolf. I can't be a wolf anymore. I've used that You one. was a wolf last night. <laughs> <laughs> I've used that line seriously to boys I've met way out on the, you know, you should come to Hollywood, you can stay with me. Bam. Oh, really? Oh, terrible. You naughty man. I'm awful. That's bad. David and Gary are also talking movies. What's your all-time favourite film? Wow. It's a tough question for you, but... Yeah, top five. Top five, yeah. Our Cecil B. DeMille, Samson, a line that with Victor Matera and Hedy Lamarr. Then Touch of Evil with Orson Welles, Marlene and Dietrich. Then Dances with Wolves with Kevin Costner and the American Indians. And number five would be Peter Pan, the animated film from Disney. <laughs> yeah? I saw that when I was 12. And that's when I became Peter Pan. <laughs> <laughs> Stephanie, D, and Kelly are talking about Gary. He's so immature. Like, if he's not hearing something that he wants to hear, he just shuts down. See, and this is because the thing. Because he is a child. And that's the thing as well. It's the if generation you put him in, if thing. If you put him in with five people his own age, that... He'd be grand. He'd be all right. Yeah. They talk that way. Yeah. I don't think so. He's Leslie's not right. a bit older. But Leslie thinks he's 21. <laughs> Yeah, no, but they're I'm both from their Hollywood. Yeah, they should yeah, have a lot Leslie, in common. They should do, but no, they don't got, click at they've all. They've got nothing in common. Leslie's because from he's from one side of the road. Yeah. He's from the other side yeah. of the road. He probably detests this Leslie, doesn't he? He doesn't like Leslie's lifestyle. How know. is he to you? He's all right, yeah, but he's just so hard. He's, he's, he's hard. I actually feel sorry for him, but I must be the only one who does. No, you're not. I go I back got, and forth. I got a real pang yesterday. I felt a couple of times because that's my nature. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like yeah, but it's, it's just a, it's just a generation thing. And plus the head injury. I've I've worked with some boxers who had their personality changes like that all yeah. the time. You know, to survive that. He was on death's door, wasn't he? Yeah. He's, he, he died. He died, he died. Well, he died you know, a couple of times, hell, you know, didn't what, I? Put, imagine, well, you can't, but imagine if you try putting yourself in his, his position. People comment on me and say things. They don't know what position. They've never been in my position. Yeah. That's never, true. If I was to, my old self, Frank Maloney, I'd be encouraging Gary to wind up someone else and yeah. I'd be going someone else to wind up yeah. Gary. I would do. Yeah. Because that was my nature. Yeah. But now that, because what I've been through, I've had time to step back. And I see things through a different Yeah, it's a reinventation, isn't it? It's yeah. like you're reinventing your, yeah. and yourself. You, and you're looking at the world in a different way. Yeah. I don't know, I don't know, Kelly. 
Your tongue is still as fucking sharp as it always been. I've heard you over this, this last few years. <laughs> Oldly, I've not had a brain transplant, just a body modification. Yes, just the body transplant. Just a body modification. Uh, you know? Oh, don't let me laugh. Twelve forty-five p.m. Gary's being quizzed about his film career. Who's the best person you've worked with, professionally? Oh, well, I like them all. Yeah. The best one, Tom Cruise, The Firm, Keanu yeah. Reeves, and Patrick Swayze, Point Break, Break Barbara Streisand, yeah. Christopherson, Star Is Born. Yeah. Um, Dustin Hoffman, straight time. Oh, I was glad, I'm so glad he said Dustin Hoffman. He got me into this business. I was 14 at the time. <laughs> and I, I was just kind of like, it's Dustin Hoffman. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, and he just said, right, work hard, learn your lines, be professional, and come back and see me in five years' time. Oh. <laughs> I've never seen him since. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine that, a chance meeting with Dustin Hoffman. He was, he's, he's, he was one of my favourite actors as well, along with your man here. Oh, my God. Stephanie is admiring her housemate's muscles. He's just got rocks in his body. He swallows rocks. He swallows rocks. <laughs> 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 like rocks. He swallows boulders. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you reckon about he's fed on babies and rocks? <laughs> I've been on a rock diet. <laughs> I got wicked muscles but shitty teeth. See, I'd, ne I'd, I'd, never that I'd never be able to get that big, ever. Uh, very few people can uh, get yeah, like that's, that. I think that too. I don't that's think a lot that's an arse, then. what you're doing there with your body. Thank God Gladiator found you. Yeah. <laughs> Back at the pool, Dee's talking about life after Benefit Street. If I could change anything in the world, I'd just want it to go back to how it was before. Mm. But that's, that's regret. That's regret. You can't go back. You can only go nah. forward. So there's no point it. in thinking that. Because you're, you're, the past is never going to be... Un, it's never going to go back to what it but is. But I've lost some really important people hey, in hey, my tell life. Me about it. Tell me about it. Let me just tell you about how lonely it gets when you get to the top. Whatever you're doing, it gets very lonely. You lose a lot of people mm. that are very important to you because it, things change. Of course, it's tough because you're the. Why did you get so? Why are you so special that you rose up and all the others are I still down know. there? That's what I people. Just don't no, I'm, know. Just, I'm not saying it to you. I'm just saying that's oh. what they're thinking in their head. They're like, yeah. well, Why did you get it? Why did we all get it? But hey, because you've got a character. Yeah. But they have as well. That's the last. No, but luck. But luck. You know, it's like. You got chosen, you just got to go with it. Yeah. That's it. tongue ripping into our celebrities. Uh, plus, we've got some uh, house action that's more shocking than George Gilby's toe-sucking session. It's really good, you don't want to miss it. <laughs> Welcome back to Celebrity Big Brother. I'm in the garden, look. Oh, I can't believe it. This is their actual stuff. Oh, it's very wet. Uh, now, <laughs> in the garden, um, tonight you are going to choose one celebrity to be the star of the show. Whoever you select will then banish two of their fellow housemates to this. This is a celebrity scrap heap. <laughs> and trust me, I'm in here. You don't want to be in here as well. Um, what they're going to have to do is sleep on the heap. Uh, so they'll have to make a little bed and stay out here because they have no access whatsoever to the house. Uh, Food-wise, they have to live off scraps, basically. So whatever's left over, that's what they get. Uh, and they're not allowed their suitcases. They have to wear these. Boiler suits. Which I know are very on-trend for autumn, winter 2014. But uh, I can't imagine some of these housemates are going to want to wear them. Uh, so, this is what's going to happen. We're going to be going live to the house to reveal the results of the poll later on this evening. Um, if you want to vote, you need to open the Celebrity Big Brother app and click on the poll icon. It's all very simple, isn't it? Uh, so, shall we head back to yesterday? Uh, brace yourselves, because there's a ton...
tiny typhoon and it's about to blow. Two ten p.m. It's the final part of the housemate's first shopman task. <laughs> Leslie and Kelly have resumed their roles as celebrity agents and will be screen testing the housemates. The agents will choose the best audition to be uploaded to Big Brother's social media sites. If the clips get enough hits, then housemates will win a luxury shopping budget. Attention, please. Job description. Huge animation studio seeks hot new talent for their latest CGI movie. Computer the ideal graphic. candidates should have some acting experience. The client would like to screen test Claire. <laughs> And Frenchie! Yeah. 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 Oh my god, we're so blonde, we better win, man. <laughs> just go with it and let it just flow and just forget there's anyone watching you. We want you to be a monster. And I would assume that with computer generated imagery, it has to be very big. Don't explain me too much because then I'm not going to be strong. Excuse me, we're the agents, you're the. Oh, person come for an audition. If you do not want to do it, there's the door. I want to do it, I'm ready. Well, then listen and take instructions <laughs> as we need you to do this. Action! character is a tree. You're a tree from Scotland. The tree is very scared of squirrels. <laughs> and unfortunately for you, they're climbing up and down your trunk. For fuck's sake, what's that? <laughs> it's a fucking little hairy beast. Get off! Get off, you horrible little critter! <laughs> what is going on with this girl? Go away! Get off me! That's just dumb like this girl! More Scottish! Go away! Go, no, no, no. Go away! <laughs> Don't like him! Tell him to get off me! Where is she from? I think it's going on me funny! <laughs> <laughs> Bring to me cars, oh, oh, God! <laughs> oh, God, this is worse than drama school. It was... <laughs> <laughs> that was excellent. Thank you. <laughs> If I'm 100% if I'm honest, I'm not sure if you come across the right way, and I really wouldn't give up your day job. <laughs> After their dramatic screen test, Kelly and Leslie picked Claire's audition to go up online. Now I know why you're a good actress. <laughs> Big Brother will reveal the results of the shop and task later on tonight. Three minutes later. One thing about it is that you're impossible to understand. Really? When you're talking in there and we're hearing you here. Can you imagine? He doesn't look so good that American. And the CGI is computer, computer <laughs> graphics. No, it's and computer generated imagery. No, not in the movies in America. It's computer graphics. I've done a oh lot. Oh my God, there we go. He I've was done, a game baby. It's okay, he's a guy. When I need your critique, I'll ask. Yeah, it's a game. It's a game. It's not fun. Come on. That's computer graphics. When I when I want your critique, I'll ask. What? When I oh. want your critique, I'll ask. Well, you don't have to ask. I'll just give it to you. And I'll say, I'll tell you to just shut the fuck up. Just because you can give me a critique as you've done before. No, I have not given you a critique, Gary. Yeah, 
No. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have managed to alienate every single Stop person angry. in this room, in this Come house. On. Come on. How do you treat your four-year-old son? Do you treat him with any kind of kindness? You act like you're this big spiritual guru, and you have not exhibited one ounce of kindness to a single person. And wipe that smirk off your fucking <laughs> face. Remember your thing. You're very funny. Remember your thing. Come no, on. You're Come on. out. Come on, come on. Out. Come on, come on. Remember, your, what did you tell me? Holt. Remember Holt. Come on. You better on. stay the fuck away from me. Come on, come on. Is it? Take some deep breaths. What's take wrong? some deep breaths. I've had it. Yeah. What? Sit down. I've had sit, it take some him. deep breaths. Sit down, take some deep breaths. He breath. just came up to me and said, no one can understand a word you say. All you do is laugh, and it's not computer-generated imagery. It's computed graphic. And I said, you want to give me some critique? Shut your fucking mouth. Oh, if honey, anyone oh. wants a critique, we'll ask for it. I said, how do you treat your four-year-old son? You think you're some He's sort awesome. of spiritual giant. You haven't exhibited one ounce of kindness, come niceness come to a down. single come fucking down. person in come this on. house. Yeah, come on, I know you're upset. Come listen, come why did you I'm let it bother you? No, 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 wait, listen, listen, babe. I gotta talk to Big Brother. I was gonna give you a hug till you shove me. Fucking hell, he's strong. He hasn't slept for four days, he doesn't help, you know? Well, he hasn't slept for four days. I would sleep on over anything, too. It's beyond. I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh. You've upset him. What? You've upset him. Careful. I just told him that, uh... He's so tired. I think he's not sleep for four days. Really? And I just think, wow. yeah. He's on edge. I just simply said what the definition is. I know, was. mate. Listen, I know. Some people don't like critique. Yeah. yeah, yeah. If you come to I me, I know, mean. I know, I know, but he's taken it maybe the wrong way. You understand? He's, he's taking it the way he's, he took he, it. Yeah, you're yeah. right. You're right. Yeah. Well, that wasn't meant to be a push. I know, I know, I know. I was not wrong. I know. Anyway. I lost my temper. I can count on my fingers the number of times I have lost my temper in sobriety in 18 years. One, two, three, four, five, twice in 24 hours. He's mean. That's a mean man. That's a horrid man. And I'm pleading with the UK, if you're watching this, please vote him out of here. We can't put up with this. He takes a huge poop and doesn't even clean the toilet. He's disgusting. He barred my clippers, and I want you to see. I wish you could try to get a camera on those feet. And then he smirks at me and says, you're a funny little man. Who knew that this was the drama I would provide? But I'm a hero to my people. I'm a hero to my people. I've been trying it 18 fucking years. CGI celebrities gone insane. <laughs> uh, ladies and gentlemen, please, please welcome someone who is brilliantly insane. Louis Wentz. <laughs> show already uh, tonight, let alone the rest of the week. I know. Um, I know we talked on bots um, yeah. the other night, but uh, just to kind of catch up, who are you loving now? Like, lo quite a lot changes in two days, doesn't it? I mean, uh, it's incredible. The first day, I thought this was going to be a really harmonious house. I thought everyone seemed really yep. nice. I thought they were going to have so much fun. Oh, well, it's just ticking off all the time, and I'm <laughs> loving it. Who am I loving the most? Well, I would say it is um, Leslie, because he's creating drama, and we want to watch drama, and mm -hmm. Gary. I mean, the pair of them together. I mean, with Gary... You Why don't know what... Gary? Well, I think because you don't know whether he's going to bite or whether he's going to bark. You know, you don't... You really don't know what's going to go on mm. with him. And also, it's... It's whether he... You sort of, does he actually register what's going on? And also, because of his hearing problem... Yeah. You know, I think that whole thing about, you know, people not listening, I think it is true. He just wants to get the conversation first so he can react. Yeah. He can't do a three-, four-way conversation. But yeah. when you're in there and something's happening and there's a good conversation going on and everyone's laughing and having a good time, you need that in there. If you have to stop every minute, it's yeah. really going to get on your nerves. So I understand the other people, but I do find him entertaining. I wouldn't want to live in there with him. He's fascinating, isn't he, as yeah. well? You just kind of want to yeah. hear everything from yeah. him. Um, I think I know who you're going to say, because we talked about this the other night, but who are you loathing? Oh, oh, let me think. Oh. Let me think. 
Oh, dear. All right, OK. Um, I would say it's someone who wore, wears tight shorts than I've got and mine are in lycra. But I've got a tight fit ass. I would say, um, James? Right, I thought that's... I thought you might say James. I thought you might say James. Uh, anybody else? Um, no, I think that... <laughs> no, I, I think it would just be, you know, there, there's enough of him for me to love. Just dislike him. Yeah. OK. Uh, so tonight, we, uh, the, the public are voting for their star of the show. Yeah. Who do you think it should be? OK, if we're talking about the star of the show, it's somebody who's been the most entertaining. And yeah. for me, it's definitely Leslie. Regardless of whether he's been a bit erratic at times or whatever, mm -hmm. I think that... The way he says things just makes me laugh. Yeah. And everything about him, his stature, everything about him just makes me laugh and I find entertaining whether it's it's good or it's bad, he entertains me. OK, and who he has, if it's him or whoever it is, they have to pick two people to put on the celebrity scrap heap. Who would you pick if it were Oh, your right. Decision? Well, I mean, a scrap heap, where do you put... What do you put I and mean, that's meant to be the least entertaining yeah. house. So it's where you put rubbish, isn't it? It's where you put trash. Yeah. It's where you put things that you tread on on the floor. Yeah. Isn't it? Come on, Things that you would spit on the ground and stamp on. Come on, Louis. Oh, look, James. Yeah. And second one. Okay, my second one would be James's ego. James and James's ego. Okay, uh, I think we need a quick breather after that. On our return, Scoop. <laughs> on this year's celeb. Plus, we'll be finding out if Leslie and Gary can ever kiss and make up. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Now, we've got even more explosive house action coming your way. I promise there is more to come. Uh, plus, this evening, one of our uh, famous faces will be given the award they have always dreamt of. Forget Gary's Oscar nomination. No one cares about Leslie's Emmy. And no one's bothered by Audley's Olympic gold medal. Because tonight, one of our celebrities will be crowned star of the show and will rule the Big Brother house. <laughs> Sam Fares is going to be here shortly to tell us who she thinks deserves to take the title. But before that, it's back to yesterday and someone's testing the water. Four forty-two pm It's been just over an hour since Leslie and Gary clashed. Leslie is cooling off in the pool. I don't want to talk to you, OK? This is my pool right now. Gary, you shouldn't be here. You should give him the space he just asked for. Will you please go away? Oh, I can get this in my pool right now. I'll honor that, sir. Thank you. This Gary, is Gary. Big Brother. Gary, come to the dining room. Hey, here we go. I will get it straight. Would Gary please go to the dining room? He's still fucking giving him that smile. All the way to the door. Stephanie, you're such a stir up. <laughs> I'm only joking. I fucking hate him. He needs to leave my Leslie alone. Hello, Gary. Hi. How are you? I'm doing my best, but sometimes it doesn't seem good enough for the other people. And I just want to be here, have a great time doing the show, be educated and learn about other people. And I'll put them down, because that's my that's the, those aren't my intentions, and the anger that keeps coming from Leslie, and even though I've asked forgiveness, she says no, no, I'm not forgiving you. You're gone. We're done. Never mind. I accept that. How did Leslie's reaction make you feel? I started smiling when he was ranting at me, and he said, "Wipe that smirk off your face." Well, to me, it was comedy because what he's reacting at was not that big a deal, in my thinking. And Leslie's thinking perhaps it was a great big deal that caused an explosion. I was showing him that I was listening to him. I accepted what he said. And when he asked me to leave, I left. No big deal. I just want to get out of the way of anybody's pain, anybody's upsetness. If there's anything I can do to help, and I will, but I have to be asked first. And when I'm asked to leave, that's fine. Oh, Gary, you're a 
Texas boys like you my whole life. I get all red and red Texas boys like you my whole life. Five or two p.m. D is missing her creature comforts. I don't know if I've missed my calendars. Calendars? You're my calendar. I've got my calendar coming out. <laughs> I've got four Stephen Gerrard. <laughs> I've we'll got, send it to yeah, I'll, I'll I've got three one. Stephen Gerrard calendars in the front room and I've got one calendar in the bedroom. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'd like to see you on my calendar. I've got a calendar, it's a good one. Have you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're one. getting one again next year? Are you uh, wearing all those tight shorts and shit? Um, I'm naked and so. No, oh, no, right! No. <laughs> really? Can I, back, can I back order it? I need to say something to Gary. Yeah. Gary. Lovely. Well, I'm sorry. Sugar. Yeah, two sugars and a little of that milk, yeah. Listen, I want to apologize for my behavior. I'm, I'm just, sorry? I want to I'm, apologize. I'm trying to hear. I've got to hear you. I want to apologize for my behavior. Oh, you do? Yeah. That's very kind. Yeah. And I want to apologize to you for saying things, saying something to you that I should have thought about before I said it. So it wouldn't, but you, you know wouldn't what? feel like you had the rug pulled out from me. But it, it has nothing to do with you. I've not been able to sleep. I'm, my blood sugar is wow. off the roof. I'm, I'm 18 years completely sober. But when I drank, they called me the tiny terror. I slap people. <laughs> I slap you. I slap people. Well, thank you very much. No, I didn't. Can I have a hug? Yeah. I'm really sorry. You bet. Mm. God bless you. Okay. Thanks. What do you mean, wait for you? Fresh air before it starts. I hope it's not bloody brick. No, it's not. Yay! Yay. That's really, we really like you. He doesn't get it at all. No. At all. That's the thing, man. You've got to understand that he yeah, doesn't get it. But I Just feel better. Just try and keep cool. Yeah. Five thirty six PM. I shit myself. Excuse me. <laughs> 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 right. Leslie is doing the washing up. I just, I just need to sleep. I'll be fine. Can you believe that that could have been a little bit of a this morning? <sighs> Edel and Dee are talking about marriage. You'd be very, very lucky if you find something nowadays, someone nowadays, that you could still do it in 45, 50 years. I thought mine was forever. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. You would because you wouldn't have married him otherwise, yeah. but... Because before I met him, I never, wasn't really ever in love properly before. When I met him, it just knocked me for six. I was like, what the hell? I actually didn't understand what love meant, really, until then. How long were you married for? Um, how long were you together before you got married? Oh, um, almost three years. See, and you still never really went into it lightly then? No. Ten years together we were. Yeah? yeah. I think I found the one now though, you know, one of them ones, yeah. Um. And he's very, very, very lucky. <laughs> lucky bastard. I know, that's nice to feel that though. It's a nice way to feel. I'm 43 now, and we haven't been together forever, you know, one of them ones kind of thing, but maybe that was the right age for us to find out each other. Yeah. Be strong, baby. Be strong. Thank you. very, very, very brave. Thank you. Mm. I, st I still feel, I do agree with you to a certain extent, but I always You yeah. don't feel that always, though, when people always go, God, you're so strong, and you're like, I don't feel it. It's really, it is really sad. Yeah, you are. It's, it's really sad when people don't. Even strong people are allowed like to have downtime, like, you know. Yeah. If ever you want to talk, babes. No. Just, hello. 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 Thank you. I mean that. Just a natural bodily function, we can't deny. 
kids have a choice. You got a choice back on. Beauty that's in front of me, it's Sam Van. Um, so again, we had Louis on a little while ago, and he yeah. told me exactly what he thought <laughs> about this uh, this series of housemates. Um, what are you, what are you thinking to them so far? It's been it's only been five days. Yeah, it feels like it's it's been five weeks because so much has happened in such a short space of time. What, what are you making to the house action so far? I think it's great. I mean, I always compare back to our house, and our house yeah. was a mad house. So I don't know if there's much comparison yet because <laughs> of how crazy ours was, but mm. I think it's brilliant. Like you know, like with Leslie kicking off and Gary. I really like Gary because the other night on bit on the side, I actually said I don't think he'll last very long, but I actually love him. I think he's hilarious. Yeah, he is, isn't he? And he's kind of he's no matter what's happening he's just yeah. getting on with it isn't, isn't he? he yeah, yeah. <laughs> and i think you know maybe they'll all kind of start to understand him soon yeah. as well because he's, he seems like quite a different creature to everybody yeah he else. is definitely um would you like to be in there with them um <laughs> <laughs> Because um, we're gonna throw you back yeah. in. <laughs> no, no, I think no, no, I'm no. all right. I no, think I'm, right. I'm enjoying watching it. <laughs> no. um, let's talk about Lauren. Yes. Your friend Lauren. Um, she's had quite a bit of attention oh, from so both uh, Ricky and George. Yes. Um, I know. What, what, what do you make to it? Do you think there'll be? Would there be interest in either of them, or either, either of them her time? I don't know. Maybe where she was a little bit drunk, it was a little bit like beer goggles. I'm not sure, but I think. Does she get a bit flirty when she has? A yeah, yeah. She's quite a flirtatious person. That's in her personality. But I would say I'd, I'd say more Ricky than okay. George. That would be her, be her type. Okay. But I don't know. Aww. Right, but you, d you don't. But know I do love George. I do would... love George. Actually, huh? you don't know if anything would actually I don't happen. think so. You don't, I don't think know. I don't know, but I don't think so. OK. Uh, so, star of the show is happening tonight. Who has been the most entertaining for you? Who would you pick? Well, it's really difficult. My mixture would be Leslie and Gary. But I think I'm probably going to say Gary, cos he's bringing so much entertainment. OK, and, and if, if it were you and you yeah. had to pick two people for the scrap heap, the least entertaining housemates, who would you go with? Um, maybe... Ricky and Adele, maybe? Is it two two people? Yeah, yeah two people. Yeah. 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 yeah, well, they've been quite mm. quiet. Quite so quiet, quiet. Yeah, 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 yeah. OK, um, Sam, thank you. Thank it was you. short, but it's always <laughs> sweet with Sam. Yeah. Um, OK, time for a slight pause in proceedings. After the break, it is round two. The gloves are off. This time, it's Frenchie versus Kelly. Plus, we're going to be chatting to Claire from Steps to find out which two celebrities she thinks will be facing tragedy on the celebrity scrap heap. See you in five, six, seven. Big Brother and a Friday night with a slight difference. Some amongst different friends tonight. Uh, now they've only been there for five days, but they better hope they've made a good impression because tonight you will decide which celebrity takes control of the house. Who is your star of the show? Head to the Big Brother app, hit the poll icon, and select your star. Now listen, in a few minutes, we're going to be joined by this lady. It's Claire from Step. <laughs> Number two. 7.35 p.m. Stephanie is cooking up the last of the sausages. Oh, those look good, Stephanie. Thanks. Are these, uh, what kind of sausages are these? Vegetarian. Fake vegetarian. I love that. I you love that. You want one? You I don't want think there's out. enough. You want it on there's bread not with enough. Yeah, that'd be Leslie, unless you're going to share yours. Would you Who, say what? There's not enough, I don't think. Yeah, there is. I don't think so. Is that all we have it for? Yes. Well, I'm OK. I'll give mine to someone who would like it more. Yeah, I said I'm not going That's my consideration. That's very nice of you. But thank you. He's never cooked or cleaned a minute in his life, so it's not like he's done that, I'm fishing that nice of anything. Frenchie and Dee are discussing the shopping list. 
I don't know yet what we get. We'll have to wait. But and do see you have an idea if it's basic? Because I have no. I like most likely I go shopping and I spend five hundred a week just to give you an idea what I do back home. Because it's organic, so I, I don't go one day five hundred. I go three. Oh, I don't think we'll have any organic in basic. No, 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 well, not in basic. Yeah. But if it's luxury, then I think I should be good. We have a shopping list, and we yeah. all have to agree. For example, they say yeah, fifteen hundred pounds. For example. 150 each, this is what you can get. I will know what to get for my money. Oh, they won't give us 1,500 pounds. Why not? It'll probably only be about 200 pounds. It's only basic mm. when we punish, but when we do good, it's a lot. It's a luxury shopping list. Mm. I read the contract, it was 14 pages. Well, then you should go upstairs to Big Brother and tell them. Is they know that? Because as far as I we know... I don't have to talk to Big Brother. Well, then that, well, then I only we'll go there if I need to. We'll, we'll see what happens. As far as I'm I know... I'm just asking your advice, so like, I don't need yeah. your advice. I'm asking D right now. Don't you start being rude. rude. No, I'm not being rude. I'm you not are. talking to you. And We're talking in a group. Hey. I was not We're talking. talking as a group. Oh, yeah. No, yeah, so. I, hey. I told you I'm talking to thee hey. and you jump in. I didn't jump in. Yeah, I'm you did. And you do that with everyone that's going on my nerves. You're getting so, on my nerves. No, nerve. Kelly doesn't hey, I'm do being, that. I'm, being, I'm sorry, but no, I'm being Kelly honest. Doesn't. No, she doesn't. She doesn't. But I'm being honest. Uh, I'm doing like saying what I'm feeling. Like I'm a very honest person. Yeah, so is And if Kevin. I think something, I'm just well, telling you, you to your face, I'm not going to go behind you. I'll tell you to your face you. as well. Don't talk to me no more. Be very nice. Okay, so don't talk to me yeah, no more because no, your energy don't is worry. negative. Don't you're ask me here. to not heal you and help you. Because right. you cried to me the first day and I right. helped you, so don't do that. That's it. Hey. No, that's not hey. no, that's Okay, not but you know what? That's Let's not. don't talk to each other. That's well, because I was talking to Dee first. You battered him. I was sitting here talking to Dee. I need to ask you Excuse me, you don't interrupt other people when they're talking. But I told okay. you when I was over there. Where's it? Well, I was talking to her first. Anyway, I was okay. just asking you a question. All oh, right, just go and you have a word. You understood what I said. Right? I do, but I think. Okay. Um, yeah. I'm good then. There you go. There you go. Oh. Okay. Yeah, just stay away from me for. Thank you very much. Hey. Hey. Frenchie. Not you, babe. Her. Oh, Sorry, Joe. Well, yeah, Listen, if you get an okay. argument with somebody, I'm not gonna get involved because I'm just talking to her. That's it. Oh, no, 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 I'm just you saying... You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't saying... want to talk to her anymore, and that's it. Yeah, that's cool. So that's that, it. That's I cool. have nothing against you. I like you. Oh, God, no, that's no. That's it, babe. Yeah, I know. So I just want to make it clear, because I'm honest. I'm just telling you how I feel right now. Listen, no, I'm honest as well, all right? What? I'm honest as well, right? No, I'm not going to fight. I'm not going to fight. I don't fight. No, 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 no. I'm not going to fight. Sit down, Cal. 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 I'm honest as well, so be very careful. No, but that's good. Be very careful. Don't cross me. That's all good. Do not cross me. Okay, do not cross me as well. Well, we'll see who crosses you first and see who comes out the best. I'm all right, like, you know what I'm saying? We'll see who comes out the first, all right? No, no, no. No, no, no. I will never get here, I swear. We're all tired. But I don't, I don't, I don't never eat on people. I never do that. No, no, no. I raise my voice, but I'm never going to. Sometimes voice raising. Yeah, You know, last night can come across as aggressive. No, I'm just saying, I want to tell her. We should not talk to each other, so it's better for you. Well, you've already told her. Don't talk no more. Okay, well, I just want to make it well, clear. Well, you've said it, and I've said it. So now tell okay, me, so get fat ass and get over there. You don't tell me uh, what to do. Go away and don't okay, talk. Okay, go away, okay? it's fine. Good. So you don't tell that's me where to go. Shit. I'm good with it. <coughs> Is this finished with? No, babe, that's all, all I right, eat. Remember, I just told you to go Do you want to take out? Cow, coming up the other end. No, I'm all right. I'm not walking away from you. No, it's not walking away. Think I'd give Graham? Yeah, of course, yeah. Don't even humour her by giving her the eye, babe. Hey, you never got this much drama on Strictly, did you? No, this is, <laughs> this is all new for me. Nine twenty-seven p.m. Big Brother has gathered the house, mate. I can't believe a little wind me up. See the same thing with me. I can't believe a little wind me up, and I need to lost it. I know. I, just, same. I stopped myself from. I know. I'm with you. She is a horrible person. Oh, she is, without a doubt, the most selfish human being. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's a, I'm aghast. This is Big Brother. For this week's shopping task, celebrity housemates had to put their talents to the test. The uploaded screen tests had to collectively match or exceed the total number of hits sealed inside the golden envelope in the agent's office. Big Brother can now reveal that housemates got a total of 8,604 hits on their audition clips. I bet we got no food. I bet we love One agent should now pull off the frame from the wall and take the envelope out. I bet we got no food. I bet we what? Uh -oh. oh my god, it's totally oh, fair, like miserably. Yeah, shit! 10,000, yeah. This is Big Brother. 
Bad luck, housemates. You have failed to impress and will receive a basic shopping delivery. The celebrity casting agency is now closed. We can't change it. All right, guys. So all right, hold it together now. Let's, let's, let's hold it together now. We'll be all right. We're going to make it work with that food. Whatever it is, we're going to make it work. <laughs> Ten thirty nine PM Kelly has come to talk to Big Brother. Today there's a dark cloud over my head. I think the I think the bedside's coming out in a few of us. Well, my, I've had a row today, so I can say it's come out in me as well. Yeah, I just got someone's just got on my nerves. And I just can't take it anymore from them. Just can't take their attitude. Their self centeredness. It's all about me, 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 me. Interrupt your conversations. Don't let anyone get a word in each way. Get in. It's just me, 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 me. So, unfortunately, she brought the worst side of me out. Normally I would apologise and try and make the peace, but you can't talk to someone who's full, is just fully self-centred. If I speak to her, I'll end up doing something I might regret. Frenchie is explaining herself to Dee. Like, if I get mad, I just blow up. I, I would never, that's why, because oh, you don't know me, so that's kind of good you did that, because you yeah, never know. Yeah. Especially in the situation like that, we just met each other. I would never, boom, never, I've never done it. But I want to be honest with my feeling. Yeah. And Being that's honest. why I told her it's better if I don't talk to her anymore. But you told her about five yeah, 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 times. Yeah, yeah, because I'm... Because you stayed there. I didn't do it on purpose, I don't think. Mm -hmm. So basically, maybe what you should have done was said, I don't want to talk to you anymore, and turned around and went off, but you come back. <laughs> But I wanted to make sure she understood it forever. Oh, no, she perfectly... For answers the rest no, of the no, show. No, she perfectly understood. So was I, I was overreacting, you think? Yeah, you should have just... The well, first time you said it, you should have walked away. and give a thunderous applause, applause or applause, again for Claire Remsett. <laughs> Are you just always Claire Remsett? <laughs> I am now. Like, you have no surname, it's just Claire Remsett. Yes, Claire it's hyphenated. Um, what are you thinking of this bunch? What do you think of our celebrities this series? My heart is going like... We were sat here he watching that, that part then, and Claire was like, <gasps> Oh, my God! <laughs> <laughs> it, it's, I mean, it's, they're quite fiery, aren't they? Yeah. They're really they're, fiery. They're um, very vocal as well with each other. There's yeah. no off to the diary room to say what we think. It's no. just... There's no biting your lip and right crying there. on your pillow. Um, <laughs> it's, it's kind of... It's all kicked off already, hasn't it? Five days in. Yeah. Um, what, what do you think to kind of what's going down? And what, what, what are your thoughts on, on all the drama that's happening? I think there's quite a few highly strung characters and they're, they're getting frayed a little bit quick, aren't they? I yeah. mean, I don't, I don't think it got like that when we were in there, when I was in there. It, not, certainly not that quick anyway. So they, all, they seem to all be very vocal and all be very happy to yeah. kind of just... There's, there's a lot going on with all of them, whereas yeah. your year, there was a lot... M most people were harmonious and then Spidey, Spidey just <laughs> kind of stirred <laughs> the pot. Yeah. Um, so again tonight we're having um, the star of the show, which is voted for by the by the viewers on the poll, yeah. um, and it's for the most entertaining housemate. So if you were going to award this to somebody, who would it be? Who's been the most entertaining for you? I think, and I don't know if it's in a good way, but I think it'd either be Gary or Leslie. I think. Why those two? I don't know. I think they've said a few things that have made me laugh. A few times, and probably, and they, I don't think they perhaps meant to be funny, but they've made me laugh. So I, so just their said, character traits sure. are yeah, making they, you laugh. Yeah, yeah. Um, and who would you send to the scrap heap? Well, oh, here we go. Purely, <laughs> just to get my own back, Stephanie on Spidey. Oh. I know it wasn't her. <laughs> 
<laughs> but that would okay, be my Okay, revenge is sweet and it comes a little while later. Poor Stephanie, she gets the... Gets my rough from my and brother, who else? he said. Um, and I think after that, Frenchie. OK. OK, so yeah. the two chicks would uh, be out She seemed for you. quite childish and very... That was all a little bit playground. It was quite strange, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Um, listen, thank you. I know it was short but sweet, but you are going to be on Bots tonight, yes, aren't you? Yes, I am. As well. Claire will be on Bots. <laughs> um, right, time for a very quick break. Uh, we'll be back really soon, though, with the final instalment from yesterday's Less Than Harmonious House. Plus, we'll be closing the poll and revealing who you have voted the start of the show. We'll see you very soon. <laughs> Brother. Now, you have been voting for your celebrity star of the show since Wednesday, and the poll will be closing shortly. We're going to be crossing live to the house to reveal the results a little bit later on. But for now, it's the final instalment from yesterday, and it's all quiet on the kitchen front. Eleven or four p.m. Leslie and Frenchie are tidying up. Lauren wants to set the record straight. Before right. we go to Can I just say something? Yeah, because I better get another picture. I think Ricky's a lovely, lovely right, Lauren, boy. Lauren, don't deny your feelings. But I mate forever. I do not... I don't fancy him. OK. Because that's I think he's a lovely boy, yeah. yeah exactly. And it makes me feel embarrassed for him, because I don't want to give him... A... No, exactly. I might get drunk and have a bit of a banter, uh -huh. a bit of a flirt, but... That's fair I enough, don't want babe. him to think that no, exactly. hey, it's going to happen. Is that it's going to happen? Exactly. So I can't. I promise I won't say yeah. anything. Yeah. <laughs> that's awkward. Because it just is. Thought you both liked each other, no. Because so. they're like, come okay. on. It's coming. I won't say anything. Yeah. I promise. <laughs> Lauren has told everyone that she thinks you're a soap mate. I'm a, I'm a what? You're a soap. I'm a soap. You're a proper fella. You're a soap. Proper good looking. You're a soap. <laughs> He's lying. Not oh, yet. <laughs> no, no, she just you said, are, I said you're a lovely, lovely guy, but I, I didn't say anything else. No, oh, yet. <laughs> she said she just you hoped... can't. She, like, no, she said she hopes TV. she can t contain you herself can't. until she, we get out of this house. <laughs> <clears throat> Edel is offering Frenchie some advice. I think everyone just has to learn a bit from what's going on. That's what I'm trying to do. And we usually learn from when things go yeah. like that, yeah. as opposed to nothing. But if you if you said it. About it. I did. No, like just say it normally because it's argumentative. Mm. So people just want to argue back with but that. But when he's explaining me stuff, I understand because like, yeah. the way he said it. Yeah. So we always, when we talk to each other, not just here, in general. Yeah. You receive differently yeah. also when you talk about something. Absolutely. And certain person, when you hear, like they tell you stuff, you get it right away. Yeah. And some other person, they would tell me another time, I still don't get it. No, absolutely. <laughs> just it's all about the delivery. Yes. Now you understand it. Mm. I'm going to go Claire. away, too. Go oh. wee-wee, babes. Did you go in the chair? You can have the chair. Oh, we have the chair, please. Nick, my bird chair. Yeah. <laughs> but I think it's going to be a tricky one, one, though. I, do, I, li I like it that she's not... Not, not, for, not for worry about her, like, the, the way she Nothing's is. Nothing's going to happen in here, you know. No, no, I want don't. that, though. I want... No, I, never, I, I would never don't. do... No, no, no. no Fuck's sake. I want to get out of here. I, I do generally like her. Enough. Like, I like doing the meal, like the, the proper side of things. She's like that, though. That's good. That's what I like, though. I know. That's what I, I really like. like. That's what I really like. I think, I think she's gorgeous. I think she's sound. She's lovely. And you're very similar because she's got that. She doesn't like all that Essex thing that's yeah. going on. She's not actually like that. She's a really nice girl. I think, I think she's, 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 she's very, she's very like. She keeps I don't bit, share my bed with just anybody, you know. She keeps everything <laughs> very close to her, though. Like yeah, if it close, like it doesn't mean, which I like, which I like though. I never get like this ever. Eleven yeah. thirty p.m. Kelly is meditating. Frenchie is the hot topic in the garden. I I don't oh, no. get Frenchie. I just don't get it. She. 
fucks about at night mm. and wakes every fucker up, couldn't give a fuck away. Well, by the way. And then she goes to bed during the day. <laughs> yeah. Whenever so I have one, it's like having like a not baby because mm. you want to keep them up so they sleep. Listen, she's, <laughs> yeah. Like yeah, I said, I don't think there's any evil person in this house. No, it's I don't. Not. No. However, there are some fucking annoying people in this house. Mm. <laughs> What's the matter? I got home. Oh. Hey? <sighs> you alright? Yeah, I just can't handle it. Handle what? I don't know. Just, can't stop worrying. I've never felt like this. I've never felt so weak and vulnerable. That's alright. It's, it's fine. It's gonna explode in a minute. You're fine. Absolutely fine, you've got nothing to worry about. I've got to get out of here. Why? I have. I've Don't just... be silly. K Kelly's crying up there. What? Kelly's crying up there. Do you want me to go up? Um, thing, thing's up there. Um, Lauren's up there. I can't stay in here no more. Why? It's like prison, I just can't stay in here. <laughs> yeah, don't be silly. We all love you. It's a hard, hard thing to do, especially for you. I can't imagine. Do you know what I mean? I've got to get out of here. No, just do you know what you need? I'm a going. good night's I'm sleep. Going. I'm gonna, no, I don't. And if I don't let me out, I'm going to climb out tonight. <laughs> don't be silly. Yeah. Don't be silly. Room for a little one. She's struggling bad. How do you think you're struggling bad? I'm breaking up. This environment here is too much. It's like shock and, what, and awe. It's too much. And what if you go out to booze? Yeah. That's gonna do not gonna do good at all. Now you've come out. Well, I know they're gonna out out her anyway. Yeah. So now you're out. That's it. The spotlight is on you. It's a big thing. You just say she's doing it for the transgender community and stuff. Worry but, about yourself, but, but I think she needs to worry about herself first yeah. before worrying about everyone else. Big time. So it's a good. It's a, what she's trying to do is honest and a good thing, but. I think you need to look into herself. You've got to be ready for it. You've got to be ready yeah, for it. Yeah, that's it. I think she's taken such a too big of a task. Do you know something? You're showing the year. Everyone's got that bit of vulnerability in them. Everyone's got that bit of fear in them. I never had vulnerability before. Yeah, but... But who are you now? Who are you now? Who are you now? Kelly. Yes. <sighs> who have you reinvented yourself as? The real me. You're not Frank. You've got traits of Frank. You have hidden Kelly for so many years. This is Kelly. Be Kelly. Be Kelly. Mm -hmm. Yeah? It's not about you've never been vulnerable. You've never been Kelly. You're Kelly now. Do you hear me? No. The show is now closed. Uh, we've now got a very short interval and then we're going to be going live to the house to reveal who you have voted your star of the show. Plus, the celebrity scrap heap opens for business. Don't go anywhere. since Wednesday and it's now time to find out who you've selected as your star of the show. So let's hand over to Big Brother who has the results. Now it's Kelly and I am. We're back to the girlfriend. That's pretty sucks. This is Big Brother. Housemates. Tonight, there will be no eviction. Oh, seriously? Oh, but, but, instead, the public have been voting for who they think oh. is the star of the show. Oh, the cool. most entertaining housemate. Oh, yeah. Big Brother can now reveal that the housemate who the public has voted as the star of the show we is... We are in George. George. No. Yes, we do. Gary. <laughs> 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 
Leslie. Congratulations, Leslie. Thank you. Do I get any You money? are now the star of the show. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. You now rule the roost in the oh. celebrity Big Brother house, and the fate of your fellow housemates is now in your hands. Yay! Yay! Go, Leslie! Go, Leslie! Go, Leslie! Go, Leslie! Go, Leslie! Go, Oh, that's good. <laughs> celebrity scrap heap. They're in our garden. Outside is a scrap heap. It's a celebrity scrap heap where celebrities who are not entertaining enough go to take a long, hard look at themselves. Oh. Two celebrities are about to be downgraded. Oh my gosh. Two celebrities. They will eat, sleep, and spend their entire day on the scrap heap. Oh, oh, I know what you seem like. Dead. Leslie, you must now decide which of your fellow housemates are the least entertaining. Oh, no. You have 30 oh, seconds to decide on which two housemates to send to the celebrity scrap heap. Oh, Don't think about it, just go. That's nothing to do with David Warner. David Warner. I love you. No, Leslie, I've been with you all the time. Leslie, reveal Leslie. your first Leslie. housemate. Leslie. No, yeah, no, it's not like that. It doesn't matter. Yes. He's got Leslie, you must make your decision now. Let him punish the people that have been mean to him. Will you go? Ah. My nose is blue. You know I can't go. I'm lucky. Because your nose is blue. She can't go because her nose is blue. Like you go. Leslie, you must make your decision now. Frenchie sure, sure. and Gary. You know I'm gonna <laughs> <laughs> Frenchie, stand up. <laughs> Frenchie, stand up. I've had brain up. surgery. I'm not going outside. Okay. There's no way I can. Leslie, explain why you chose Frenchie. Just go ahead, it's all good. No, no, no. I have to pick the two. Everyone has been so kind to me and so loving, and I've only had a fracas with two, so yeah, how do fair. I choose? That's well, you fair, asked, that's You fair. asked forgiveness for me, and I gave that's it to fair. you. And, and <gasps> as it did with her, but how can I put that on anybody that's been extremely sweet to me and welcoming, and and I have she cut up my underwear. I mean, what Jesus. <laughs> Gary. I can't go. Leslie, because of my <laughs> reveal your second housemate. My second housemate is Gary. <laughs> but I can't go out there physically. Gary, stand up. <laughs> I knew we were all going to be in trouble. Leslie, explain why you chose Gary. Once again, everyone has been so welcoming and sweet. And from day one, I didn't feel that. Now I do. We've, we've apologized. Yeah. You uh, have, and I've accepted it. He apologized, and I accepted <clears throat> it. But how can I pick someone who's cooked for me and loved me and, and, and came in and when I was in trouble? And how could I pick that? Yeah, it's awesome. I've helped you. <laughs> <laughs> well, not like the others have. Well, I've helped you the best Fred, way I could at the time. Said, well, I know, but how do you pick? Frenchie what? and Gary. Leslie has chosen you as the two least entertaining housemates. Okay. There's one more thing, housemates. Oh, Whoever ends up on the celebrity scrap heap also I can't, faces I can't eviction. Sleep out there. We'll talk to more you. will join Frenchie and Gary oh, over the coming days. No. Okay. We're all going to end up on this. I would rather you went in. I would rather you two went in in case I. Yeah. Yeah. Scrap Heap is open and more celebs will be added to the pile over the weekend. Whoever's left on top of the Scrap Heap on Sunday will face the first live eviction on Wednesday night. Uh, now, before we say goodbye, I can tell you it's been another extraordinarily explosive day in the house. So here's a little teaser of what you can expect in tomorrow night's show. I'm going to be loud, loud, loud! Loud, loud, loud! 
Don't fucking play games with me, girl, because you don't know your okay. fucking words. Shut the fuck up. I'm not fucking up. Please. Get the I'm fuck not. out of here. I'm not. I didn't do nothing with the food. I, I saw it. you. I you was in the You stinking French slut. What is that? They're my um hundred dollar Shawshay Banks underwear that she took scissors to. <gasps> Can I get some assurances from Big Brother that I don't have to be afraid that I'm going to get stabbed? <laughs> This man is shocked. Oh my God. Uh, we're going to be talking through all the drama of the latest twist, plus more exclusives from today with the help of Lauren Harry's, Michelle Heaton, BB14's Ashley, and Claire from Steps. So hurry up and get yourself down here, girl. It's going to be good. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. Uh, Ryland's going to be followed by Live from the House. And as ever, the Big Brother website is jam packed with all the house news that you could possibly need. The highlight show will be back tomorrow night at 9 pm. And I'll see you back here next Wednesday for the first live eviction of the series. Thanks for watching and good night. Is it taking care of food very well? Yeah. And the very understanding is for free. Fuck time. Oh my god. Huh? Well, this is my nose in the Don't think that I was hearing that. Yeah, barely. Big brother will Big sort brother. it out. Oh, that's what they just told me. Yeah. But don't, don't blame Leslie, because yeah, it's a game. He just said to me, he said to me, this is not something that is good sport. I'm missing the most Oh my God. I'm doing it, for sure. It's the game, though. I have to play the game. He didn't really have any Gary, we got to do this man. We're going to be on the Do you have your stuff to sleep, right? I'm not going to be sleeping out there. I'm going with you. I'm not going to be sleeping out there. I'm not going to be sleeping out there. Okay, so then I'm not talking about it. I have to tell him to go. Okay, okay. Well, I'm going, yeah. I just need clothes, that's it. I know. Just, just, um... Fucking... Fucking... Hey, you're outside. Look, that's perfect. Is that what I can see from? Because that's a...